guess that's the first time you beat me, eh? I can't ever remember you beating me before. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Are you sure you're okay? Do you want to talk about it? Uh, I'll be okay. I just have to work some stuff out. Are you nervous about being a dad? The day that you were born, the truth is, I didn't feel much joy because the disappointment that I felt seemed to be stronger than the great event which represents having a child. I had always wanted a boy. Two days after the birth, I went to pick up my two women. As time went by, I was left captivated by your smile and began to love you with all your heart. You always gave me everything I needed. Thankfully, I didn't always get everything I wanted. When I begged for it the most, I needed it the least. When you first fell at age 11, your mother and I both knew that the chances of you developing this heart disease were high. I wasn't scared. I knew that if you were beside me, I would have nothing to be afraid of. Back then, I had no idea what you were capable of. When we were in the hospital, and I found out that you didn't have much of a chance, I prayed to God and asked Him to enlighten me and give me the strength, strength to do absolutely everything in my power. At the time, I couldn't understand why. But now I can truly, truly appreciate what you did for me. I am forever grateful. When you asked me if you were going to die, after hearing from the doctors... You promised me you'd never see me die. And if you died, you could come back whenever you want and see your mother and me from above. You told me you'd never leave me alone. And that one day something were to happen to you and you did die. You'd find a way to communicate with me. I have never thought twice or regretted the decision I made. You'd use the wind to come and see me. 